This is a compilation of part 1 to 5 of 1000 daily Tamil phrases, so you can learn them all in one video. If you wish to learn Tamil in the shortest possible time, in a structured and entertaining method, check my entire video, learn and speak Tamil like a native, or just click the link above. Welcome to learn and speak Tamil like a native, lesson number 70, and this is the first part of 1000 useful daily phrases. Instead of random 1000 phrases, let us go by subject by subject. So every time you see a lesson, it is about one theme. We'll try to make 1000 phrases so it can make many lessons. By the way, if you have any theme in mind, let me know, I'll make a lesson on that. In this part one, we are going to see greetings and how to say hello, hi, how are you? How are you? This is a respectful form. You can use it for elders and even in a very formal situation. This is a very informal term. You can use it for your friends, your peers, your colleagues or younger children. It has been a long time we met. Path Rumbanal Agad. Path Rumbanal Agad. For transliteration and pronunciation, check my lesson number 68, which can be a useful aid for you to pronounce rightly. I am good. Na nalla irke. Na nalla irke. Or you can just say nalla irke, which also means I am good. Na nalla irke. Or are you good? Are you fine? Nalla irkingala? Nalla irkingala? This is also a very common phrase to start a conversation. Though in English we do not say Nalla irkingala, are you fine? Are you okay? Which means the person was not good for some time. However, in Tamil it is okay to say, Are you okay? Are you fine? It's a very common conversation. It's a way to start the conversation. It's very normal. Another variant of asking, are you good? Means, saukyama irkingala. Or you can even say, saukyama. It is enough to say, saukyama. Meaning, are you well? In this context, it means your well-being, your overall well-being, your good state. Are you good? Saukyam is being a good state or a well-being. So this is also okay to say, are you, are you in a good state? Means it's perfectly normal to start a conversation saying, Saukyama, Saukyama irkingala. How are things? How are things going? Yella, eppadi pogudu? Yella, eppadi pogudu? Means everything. Yella, everything. Eppadi pogudu? How are things going? It's again more common within familiar people because you know them and then you're asking, how are things going with you? Yella, eppadi pogudu? Is everyone fine at home? Veetile ellarom, saukyama? So you're asking, veetile at home, ellarom, everyone? Saukyama, are they, are they good? Are they in a good? Are they well? That's the meaning. Veetile ellarom, saukyama? So when a native speaker asks, it will be like, Vitla Elaro Saukema, Vitla Elaro Saukema. Convey my regards. Kate Tada Sulunga. Kate Tada Sulunga. Kate Tada means Sulunga is tell them. Sulunga, tell. Kate Tada means just I inquired, I asked. Kate Tada Sulunga. Send my regards. Visar Chada Sulunga. Visar Chada. Visar Chada means that I inquired. Sulunga. Tell. Meaning we asking them to tell them that I inquired about them. Visar Chada Sulunga. Visar Chada Sulunga. Sure, I'll pass on your regards. Kandipa Sulare. Kandipa means certainly or definitely. Sulare. I will tell. I will, meaning I will pass on, 
ஐ டெஃபினெட்லி டெல் தம் தட் யூ என்கொயர்ட் கண்டிப்பாக சொல்கிறேன் கண்டிப்பாக சொல்கிறேன் ஸோ அஸ் யூ கேன் சி த இங்கிலீஷ் அண்ட் தமிழ் வில் ஹாவ் அ டிஃப்ரெண்ட் காம்பினேஷன் ஆஃப் வேர்ட் ஸோ வி டோன்ட் ஹாவ் டு ஹாவ் அ வேர்ட் பை வேர்ட் ட்ரான்ஸ்லேட்டர் ட்ரான்ஸ்லேஷன் இட் டசன்ட் மேக் சென்ஸ் ஸோ ஐ எம் யூஸிங் த அப்ராப்ரியேட் தமிழ் வேர்ட்ஸ் தட்ஸ் பெஸ்ட் சூட்டபிள் ஃபார் திஸ் கான்டெக்ஸ்ட் கண்டிப்பாக சொல்கிறேன் கண்டிப்பாக சொல்கிறேன் அண்ட் தட் ஸ்மால் யூ அண்ட் ஸ்மாலர் லெட்டர்ஸ் ஹியர் அண்ட் தேர் யூல் சி இஸ் ஜஸ்ட் அ மோர் அ குவிக்கர் சவுண்ட் லைக் சொல்கிறேன் people say sollure people don't say sollure instead they say sollure you can see that uh, just shortened that's what you can it's very important that you listen to how i pronounce the words and phrases kandipa sollure glad to meet you ungala paathadala sandosham or you can even say paathadala sandosham ungala means you paathadala in in seeing sandosham happy i am glad that i i have met you or i have seen you ungala paathadala sandosham or paathadala sandosham pleased to have met you all now we are talking about not just one person we are happy that we met many people probably the whole family so i say pleased to have met you all it's pleased to meet you all it means the same உங்கள் எல்லாரையும் பார்த்ததில் ரொம்ப சந்தோஷம் உங்கள் எல்லாரையும் பார்த்ததில் ரொம்ப சந்தோஷம் ஆர் யூ கேன் சே எல்லாரையும் பார்த்ததில் சந்தோஷம் ரொம்ப இஸ் ஜஸ்ட் அ மோர் அடிங் என் இட்ஸ் அ ரொம்ப சந்தோஷம் வெரி ஹாப்பி சந்தோஷம் இஸ் ஹாப்பி சேம் ஹியர் மீன்ஸ் எனக்கும் தான் எனக்கு மீன்ஸ் ஃபார் மீ தான் இட்ஸ் ஸ்ட்ரெஸ்ஸிங் அஃப்கோர்ஸ் ஆல்சோ ஃபார் மீ இட்ஸ் த சேம் ஃபார் மீ எனக்கும் தான் எனக்கும் தான் ப்ளீஸ் விசிட் அஸ் சம்டைம் ஒரு நாள் வீட்டுக்கு வாங்க ஒரு நாள் வீட்டுக்கு அங்க வாங்க ஒரு நாள் மீன்ஸ் ஒன் டே பட் வாட் த மீனிங் ஹியர் இஸ் கம் ஆன் அ டே கம் சம்டைம் கம் சம்டைம் வென் யூ ஃபைன் டைம் வீட்டுக்கு மீன்ஸ் டு ஹோம் வாங்க ப்ளீஸ் கம் ஒரு நாள் வீட்டுக்கு வாங்க ஒரு நாள் வீட்டுக்கு வாங்க stay in touch so in tamil we say appapo phone seyunga <coughs> appapo phone seyunga or phone pannunga appapo means every now and then you know frequently that's the meaning phone seyunga means give a call phone pannunga you can also say phone pannunga appapo phone seyunga or appapo phone pannunga Oh, certainly I will. Nichyama pannare. Nichyama pannare. Nichyama means certainly or of course. Pannare. I will do. Nichyama pannare. We'll see you soon again. Sikrame marubadiyam bapo. Sikrame means very soon. Soon. Marubadiyam. Once again. Bapo. We'll meet. Or we'll see. சீக்கிரமே மறுபடியும் பார்ப்போம் சீக்கிரமே மறுபடியும் பார்ப்போம் ஆர் பார்ப்போம் தஸ் அ நெக்ஸ்ட் ஒன் ஷல் ஐ லீவ் போயிட்டு வரட்டுமா தஸ் அ செப்பரேட் லெசன் ஃபார் திஸ் ஹாவ் அர்லி யூ வில் ஃபைன் தட் இன் ஒன் ஆஃப் மை லெசன்ஸ் போயிட்டு வரட்டுமா பீப்புள் டோன்ட் சே ஷல் ஐ கோ இன்ஸ்டட் பீப்புள் சே போயிட்டு வரட்டுமா ஷல் ஐ கோ அண்ட் கம் பேக் தட்ஸ் அ மீனிங் பட் த மீனிங் இஸ் ஷல் ஐ டேக் அ லீவ் ஷல் ஐ டேக் அ லீவ் போயிட்டு வரட்டுமா போயிட்டு வரட்டுமா போயிட்டு வரட்டுமா ஆர் யூ கேன் ஜஸ்ட் சே வரட்டுமா மீனிங் ஷல் ஐ கம் த மீனிங் இஸ் ஷல் ஐ லீவ் தேர் இஸ் அ செப்பரேட் வீடியோ ஐ ஹாவ் மேட் ஜஸ்ட் டு எக்ஸ்பிளைன் திஸ் போயிட்டு வரட்டுமா யூ கேன் லேர்ன் தட் இன் த வீடியோ ஜஸ்ட் கிளிக் அபவுட் தேர் சி யூ மீன்ஸ் பாப்போம் பாப்போம் மீனிங் Let us see again means papo okay for now papo
In this second lesson of the thousand phrases, we are seeing a scenario where you want to take a taxi. So you are telling to a taxi man that you want to go to the airport. So the first phrase is, I have to go to the airport. Airport ku pogano. Airport ku pogano. You can use the word airport, which is very commonly used. Which is, though it's an English word, it's okay to use it. Airport ku pogano. Are you coming? It's, you are asking the taxi man, are you coming? Varingala? Varingala, meaning, or, which also means, are you available to come? Varingala? Are you coming? Are you coming? Varingla? Could you put the luggages in the trunk? That is, you're asking the taxi man for help. You're asking, can you put the luggages in the trunk? That is, luggage ala edutthu dikkila vikkiringla? Luggage ala edutthu, that is, take the luggage and all and Dikki le dikki dikki is a very commonly used word. It originates from some other language, which means trunk, the trunk of the car. Dikki and in the dikki means dikki le vakiringla. Can you keep it? Luggage la adathe dikki le vakiringla. And as you get in, you are asking, please stop on the way. The reason could be you just want a small pause. Please stop on the way. Vari la konjo nerithunga. Vari la konjo nerithunga. That is, vari la means on the way. Konjo, just. Nerithunga, stop. Vari la konjo nerithunga. Let me buy some water. Tanni vangi kere. Tanni vangi kere. Tanni vangi kere. Could you stop for 10 minutes on the way? Vari la uru patthu nimishom. Uru patthu nimishom means for some 10 minutes. Vari la uru patthu nimishom nirutha mudima. Could you stop? Vari la uru patthu nimishom nirutha mudima. Are there any shops on the way? Pora vari la kada yadavad irukkuma. Pora vari la means on the way. Kada yadavadu, any shops or something? Irukkuma, will it be there? Pora vali ila, kada yadavadu irukkuma? Pora vali ila, kada yadavadu irukkuma? It is there near the toll gate. I'll stop, sir. So the taxi man says, it's there. There's one near the toll gate. I'll stop. So, toll gate kitta irukku. Toll gate kitta means nearby. Irukku, it is there. Nerithran, sir. So it's very common people using the word, sir. Toll gate kitta irukku. Nerithran, sir. Can we reach on time? Because you are, you are worried that we are running short of time. So you are asking, can we reach on time? Sariyana nerathukku poyidlama. Sariyana means the right. Nerathukku at the time. Sariyana nerathukku poyidlama. Will we be able to go? Or will we, will we be able to reach? Sariyana nerathukku poyidlama. Will there be a lot of traffic on the way? Vari ila rumba traffic irukkuma. Vari ila rumba. Rumba means a lot of. Traffic irukkuma. Will it be there? Vari ila rumba traffic irukkuma. Go slow. Millama ponga. Millama ponga. Go a bit more faster. Inno konjo means a little more, a bit more. Vega ma ponga. Go faster. Inno konjo vega ma ponga. Inno konjo vega ma ponga. Will there be anything available to eat nearby? Sapada inge pakkatla yadavad kadikima. Sapada means to eat. Inge pakkatla. Here, nearby, Yedavadu Kadekema, will anything be available? Sapada inga pakkatla yedavadu Kadekema? Sapada inga pakkatla yedavadu Kadekema? 
இஸ் ஏ நியூ ரெஸ்டாரண்ட் நியூ பை ஹோட்டல் ஏதாவது இங்கே இருக்கா ஹோட்டல் இட்ஸ் வெரி காமன்லி யூஸ்ட் வேர்ட் ஃபார் ரெஸ்டாரண்ட் அண்ட் பீப்புள்ஸ் ஏ ஹோட்டல் இஸ் தேர் அ ஹோட்டல் நியூ பை இட் கேன் மீன் அ பிளேஸ் டு ஸ்டே ஆர் இட் கேன் ஆல்சோ மீன் அ பிளேஸ் டு ஈட் ஸோ பட் மோர் ஐ வுட் சே காமன்லி யூஸ்ட் இஸ் when people say hotel they more mean a place to eat so hotel la edavadu or hotel edavadu inga iruka is any hotel nearby even a coffee or a tea will do coffee tea kodam podum coffee tea kodam means even a coffee or a tea podum will be enough will just that will do coffee tea kodam podum Please push back the seat. Seat a konjo, pinnadi thallunga. Seat a konjo, konjo means just, or that's a very polite way of saying something. Konjo, pinnadi, backwards. Thallunga, push it a little back. Push it a little backwards. Seat a konjo, pinnadi thallunga. Seat a konjo, pinnadi thallunga. It is congested here. means you have no room for your legs or to keep your luggages or your extra things you are saying it is very congested here inge nerukama irukk inge nerukama irukk i have reached the airport or we have reached the airport so airport vandaachi which means we have re- it doesn't clearly explain whether it is i or we it just said airport reached airport reached we have reached the airport anything airport vandaachi airport vandaachi oh is it so please park it inside park the car inside that's the meaning appadiya means is it so is oh we have arrived ulle nerthunga park it inside appadiya ulle nerthunga let me get down let me get down na erangikiren na erangikiren thank you so much you drive good you drive very good that's the appreciation you want to give romba nandri means thank you so much neenga vandi nalla otrringa neenga vandi nalla otrringa romba nandri neenga vandi nalla otrringa I have uploaded several lessons in order of numbers. The different colors of the thumbnail denotes different type of lessons, such as green for short, useful beginner phrases, blue for conversation, dark or navy blue for tips and nuances, purple for grammar, etc. You can find that on my channel or just click the button up there to explore. I'll be making many more videos for you to learn. So if you have any suggestions or questions, please let me know. If you like the video please subscribe and like all the best with your tamil learning vanakkam vaarthukal In this learn and speak Tamil like a native lesson number 73 you are going to learn phrases related to weather you can also check my previous lessons and this is the third part and i'm teaching a bunch of phrases related to one theme instead of random phrases so it's easy for you to understand and remember and it's also easy when you want to come back and check some of the words or phrases it's easy for referring back So let's see the first one now weather The first phrase is it is cold and now it is January here in India it's obviously a cold season at least for Indians how to say that you could say kulura irukku kulur is cold 
when you say kulura irukke it is cold you feel cold kulura irukke it is cold kulura irukke it is cold and humid pani peyidu it is very common to hear this from especially pani means something like a humid and cold cold with humid where it's usually in the night and the early mornings where you'll see dew drops on the leaves and that means pani it has it's been cold and it's been humid the humidity settles on you so people say pani paniya irukku or pani peyidu it is like rain this is also because it's coming from up down we say peyidu pani peyidu it is breezy and this is something we used to say it is something pleasant like in english we say it's nice breeze so kaathu varudhu meaning there's the air flow it's breezy nice breeze pleasant so kaathu varudhu kaathu means air varudhu it is coming means the air is flowing there's a breeze that's the meaning it is breezy kaathu varudhu now we are talking about a little stronger air flow and that is windy kaathu adikidu means adikidu is just its flows you know it's a little stronger kaathu adikidu it is windy so we say kaathu adikidu close the door kadava moodu kaathu adikidu means the air flow is faster it's getting windy we are talking about something more than a breeze kaathu adikidu the earlier one was kaathu varudhu which is the air is flowing now we are talking about kaathu adikidu the wind is blowing hard vegama kaathu veesudhu vegama means fast kaathu veesudhu veesudhu is this time we are talking about a strong blow of wind so kaathu veesudhu vegama kaathu veesudhu it is cyclone storm poyal kaathu adikidu poyal kaathu means the cyclone storm poyal kaathu adikidu poyal kaathu adikidu it is hurricane storm suravali kaathu adikidu suravali means something like a hurricane much more stronger it comes circling and it can really be a little devastating suravali it's suravali kaathu adikidu it is slightly drizzling lesa lesa means slight lesa thural podudu thural podudu means it's drizzling you can just say thural podudu thural podudu means it is drizzling lesa thural podudu means it's slightly drizzling and if you want to understand better the transliteration that i've used like the capital a the th the big o the capital e you can check my lesson and or you can just click up it's easier for you to understand the translation but transliteration but for now it's better for you to listen to how i pronounce because these are small sentences and it's very important that you pronounce it rightly it is drizzling wind close the door it is drizzling wind close the door that is this is a very unique word like mara saral means when there when it's raining and there's wind along with that the water could be coming inside like if you're sitting inside the home having the windows open still there because of the wind the air could be the uh, rain could be flowing inside so this is what we call as saral i cannot immediately remember a word for that in english but that's why i made it a drizzling wind so that it's like it you feels like the water's drizzling inside that's towards you but it's not because of just rain it's also because the wind flowing we say saral saral mara close the door man vasanai varudhu meaning the smell of the sand we don't use this so much in english but this is actually not the smell of the sand but when the when it rains when the earth is hot and then suddenly when it rains you could smell the fine dust will have kind of a unique smell and it has another meaning in tamil that is man vasana is something very nostalgic so man vasana is 
something that makes you to remember the habits of the native so man vasanai the smell of the sand is wafting through the air man vasane varudu you can hear this word being used in many contexts and there was also a famous movie i suppose it is lightning idi minnala irukku idi is thunder minnal irukku we say idi minnala irukku there is a tv announcement that there could be cyclone or there would be a cyclone tv la poyal varonu solranga so because the announcements are made in television tv la poyal varonu that the rain will come solranga they are saying so this is a poyal varonu that there will be a cyclone if you want to understand that particular grammar you can click the link above poyal varonu means that there will be a rain or sorry that there will be a cyclone solranga they are telling or they are announcing tv la poyal varonu solranga kuda kondu ponga and because it is raining it's better to take the umbrella take an umbrella kuda kondu ponga take an umbrella kuda kondu ponga looks like the rain has start mala vitta madri irukku mala that's a rain vitta madri like it has start irukku it is so it seems like the rain has start mala vitta madri irukku i have uploaded several lessons in order of numbers the different colors of the thumbnail denotes different type of lessons such as green for short useful beginner phrases blue for conversation dark or navy blue for tips and nuances purple for grammar etc you can find that in my channel or just click the button up there to explore idi idikide meaning the thunder thunders there is thundering sound minnal minnad minnal is again the lightning minnad is it's this lightning the what we mean is the light it produces minnad is also some we mean something sparkling nakshatra minnad or the gold minnad means it's sparkling it's something that is sparkly idi idikidu minnal minnad that is we are talking about the thunders and the lightning it rains heavy chon mala peyudhu this cho is doesn't have meaning by itself but what we are meaning it's more like a, a word that to add the intensity to the rain let us chon it's like oh it rains like doom it rains something they say like bang it sounds so it's similar to that chon mala peyudhu chon mala peyudhu it rains cats and dogs when you want to say something like it's been terrible rain we also say pay mara pay is devil so that's been devilish rain pay mara peyid it is cloudy or it is overcast mega mutama irukku means it's all getting very cloudy it's not a clear sky mega mutama irukku vaano moodikittu irukku means the dark and clouded it's it's getting really dark the clouds are getting dark that it looks like it's going to rain any time it is dark and clouded vaano moodikittu irukku the literal meaning for that is the sky seems covered the sky seems covered the sky is seem covered i think i made it a little wrong there the sky seems covered so it means that it's dark and clouded vaano moodikittu irukku the clouds are getting darker irittikittu varudhu here we mean we are not talking about it's getting dark and we are nearing the night instead we are talking about that clouds getting darker and it might rain any time irittikittu varudhu so irittikit means it's getting suddenly getting darker irittikittu varudhu
This is the 74th episode of Learn and Speak Tamil Like a Native and in this video we are going to see vocabularies and phrases related to in the market. So this is part 4 of the 1000 daily Tamil phrases but if you want to know more about it click in the link or in the description below for the playlist of the entire list of videos under 1000 daily Tamil phrases. We are going to see the first phrase now. How far is the market? Market evlo duranga. Market evlo duranga. And inga is added to add respect. Market evlo durang. You can also ask that, but adding inga adds a little more respect to the phrase. Market evlo duranga. What is available in the market? Market le enna kadekyo? Market le, that is in the market. Yenne kadekyo? What is available? Market le, yenne kadekyo? Clothing, household things, everything will be available. Tuni money, tuni money means clothing. Beat jama, household things, yella me kadekyo? Tuni money, beat jama, yella me kadekyo? How much is the shirt? In the satta evlo, how much is this shirt in the, that is this, satta shirt evlo, how much is it? In the satta evlo. You are asking a high price. Vela jasti solringe. Vela jasti solringe. Vela is the price, jasti is a lot. Solringe, you are telling, you are telling a high price. You are asking a high price. Vela jasti solringe. Or you can alternatively say Vela Adigama Soldringa. Vela Adigama Soldringa. Vela is the price. Adigama. Again, it also means a lot. Vela Adigama Soldringa. Cannot you give it any cheaper? Vela Kami Panna Mudiada. Vela, that is the price. Kami Panna to lessen. Mudiada. Cannot you? Vela Kami Panna Mudiada. And you can. Ask it in a more, more polite tone, which may not be so commanding. Vela kami panna mudiyada? Or Vela kami panna mudiyada? Alternatively, you can also say, could you not decrease the price? Which means kunjo, which is adds a little more like kunjo is like just, just cannot you. That is like kunjo korekya mudiyada? Cannot you lessen it? We are talking about the price. Kunjo means please or just. Korekka mudiyada. Cannot you lessen it? Show me some other. Where a kamige? You are asking show some other things. Not this. That is the meaning here. Where a kamige? Please show something else. Where a kamige? And it is always good to add that nge because you are talking to a stranger. Could be elderly person. So it is always good to Talk to a stranger with adding nge at the end. Where a kamige? Ida veda you know, nallada kamige? That is, show me something better than this. Ida veda means more than this or than this. Inno nallada, that is, much more better. Ida veda inno nallada kamige? Please show. Ida veda inno nallada kamige? Show me some sandals to wear during rains. Show me sandals. Sandals is the flip-flop kind of a more a covered one. Maraki poda. Sirpu kamige? Maraki poda. Mara is rain. Maraki poda. That is for the rain. Sirpu kamige? Sirpu is the footwear. Sirpu kamige? Will it be long-lasting? That is, nalla varakkema. We are concerned about the endurance or durability of the product. We are asking, nalla varakkema. Can it be rough and tough? It is not fitting well. It is tight. Patta maattadu. Irukkama irukku. Patta maattadu means it is not fitting. Patta maattadu. Irukkama irukku. It is very tight. Oh, it's just only to wear at home. We are asking, 
we have want something not for the out to wear outside but only to wear at home vero veetla podatha vero means just or only veetla podatha to wear at home not the expensive ones show me just the ordinary ones romba velaila vena means romba velaila means not of the high price romba velaila vena i don't want romba is lot chumma chumma is a word we use like a filler word means just sadharanama kamiga show just the ordinary ones sadharanama means ordinary kamiga please show romba velaila vena chumma sadharanama kamiga how much do you ask for this id evlo solreenga id evlo solreenga id evlo solreenga what time will you open the shop ethana maniki kada tarpinga ethana maniki mean what time kada tarpinga will you open the shop ethana mani kada tarpinga i am buying this to give someone id gift kuduka vaangren gift is commonly used in though it's not a tamil word it's okay to use idu gift kuduka vaangra can i exchange if it is not okay what you mean is if you're not satisfied or you are buying it for somebody and if they don't like it can i replace it that is sari illana sari illana means if it is not good or if it is not okay maathikalama can i change it can i exchange it sari illana maathikalama sari illana maathikalama so this the we have seen quite many words and if you want to learn more tamil i have made more than 75 videos so far and which is grammar phrases conversation you can benefit out of them so we are coming to the end if you like the video or if you are liking all the any of the videos please subscribe you can click the bell icon to watch more videos in this learn and speak tamil like a native we are going to see words and phrases related to the interior of a house this is the fifth part of 1000 daily tamil phrases If you want to access my other videos please click in the description below you'll find all the details or if you want to learn more tamil there's a very step by step videos which also you'll find in the description The first phrase is someone is standing at the entry vaasalla yaro nikkaranga vaasalla means in the entry yaro nikkaranga someone is standing someone is standing at the entry you can also learn one vocabulary here which is vasal which is the entry to a place which is more we use for a house vasal vasal la yaro nikranga i left the keys hanging in the door saavi kadavula maati irken saavi kadavula maati irken saavi means key kadavu this is another word for you to learn kadavu means door saavi kadavula மாட்டி இருக்கேன் ஐ லெஃப்ட் த கீஸ் ஹேங்கிங் இன் த டோர் சாவி கதவில் மாட்டி இருக்கேன் இஃப் யூ ஓப்பன் த விண்டோஸ் யூ வில் கெட் ஏர் ஜன்னலை திறந்தா காத்து வரும் ஜன்னலை திறந்தா காத்து வரும் ஜன்னல் இஸ் அனதர் வேர்ட் ஃபார் யூ டு லேர்ன் ஜன்னல் மீன்ஸ் விண்டோ ஜன்னலை திறந்தா இஃப் யூ ஓப்பன் த டோர் ஐ ஹவ் மேட் அ வீடியோ டு எக்ஸ்பிளைன் சென்டென்சஸ் வித் இஃப் யூ கேன் ஃபைண்ட் இன் த பிளேலிஸ்ட் ஜன்னலை திறந்தா காத்து வரும் காத்து இஸ் ஏர் வரும் வில் கம் ஸோ யூ வில் கெட் ப்ரீஸ் இஃப் யூ ஓப்பன் தி டோர் இஃப் யூ ஓப்பன் த விண்டோ ஜன்னலை திறந்தா காத்து வரும் ஐ ஹவ் ஆல்ரெடி மேட் செவன்டி ஃபைவ் லெசன்ஸ் ஆல் இன் டிஃப்ரெண்ட் கலர்ஸ் டினோட்டிங் டிஃப்ரெண்ட் லெசன்ஸ் பர்பிள் மீன்ஸ் கிராமர் கிரீன் மீன்ஸ் பிக்னர் லெசன்ஸ் டார்க் ப்ளூ மீன்ஸ் கான்வர்சேஷன் யூ கேன் பெனிஃபிட் அவுட் ஆஃப் தெம் all the details will you will find them in the description below now let us move on to the next phrase the lights are on in the prayer room the lights are on 
பூஜை அறையில் பூஜை அறையில் மீன்ஸ் த ப்ரேயர் ரூம் ஆர் த பிளேஸ் வேர் யூ ஹாவ் த பிக்சர்ஸ் ஆஃப் காட் பூஜை அறையில் விளக்கு எரியுது விளக்கு மீன்ஸ் த லைட் ஸ்டில் ஆன் விளக்கு எரியுது பூஜை அறையில் விளக்கு எரியுது பூஜை அறை இஸ் அனது வெக்கேபுலரி ஃபார் யூ டு லேர்ன் பூஜை அறை மீன்ஸ் அ ரூம் ஃபார் ரிச்சுவல்ஸ் அண்ட் ப்ரேயர்ஸ் பூஜை அறையில் விளக்கு எரியுது ஐ ஹாவ் பிளேஸ்ட் இன் அ கார்னர் அதை மூளையில் வச்சுருக்கேன் அதை மீன்ஸ் தட் ஒன் மூளையில் இந்த கார்னர் ஸோ மூளை இஸ் கார்னர் அதை மூளையில் வச்சுருக்கேன் ஐ ஹவ் பிளேஸ்ட் இட் இன் அ கார்னர் அதை மூளையில் வச்சுருக்கேன் There are two rooms upstairs. There are two rooms upstairs. Maadi le. Maadi le means in the upstairs. That is we are talking about on the floors above you. So that means Maadi. Maadi means <coughs> higher floors. The floors above you is Maadi. Rindu ara irukku. Rindu is two. Ara is room. மாடியில் ரெண்டு அறை இருக்கு தேர் ஆர் டூ ரூம்ஸ் அப்ஸ்டேர்ஸ் கீப் தட் இன் த ரூம் அதை அறையில் வச்சிடு ஸோ திஸ் இஸ் மோர் ஆஃப் அ ஆர்டர் அதை அறையில் வச்சிடு கீப் தட் இன் த ரூம் அதை அறையில் வச்சிடு அறை இஸ் ரூம் இட் இஸ் ஹாட் அண்ட் ஹியூமிட் இன் த கிச்சன் சமையல் அறையில் ஸோ சமையல் அறை இஸ் அனதர் வேர்ட் ஃபார் யூ டு லேர்ன் சமையல் அறை மீன்ஸ் த கிச்சன் சமையல் மீன்ஸ் குக்கிங் அறை இஸ் ரூம் த குக்கிங் ரூம் தட் இஸ் த கிச்சன் சமையல் அறையில் புழுக்கமாக இருக்குது இட் இஸ் ஹியூமிட் அண்ட் ஹாட் சமையல் அறையில் புழுக்கமாக இருக்குது வாட்டர் டஸ் நாட் ஃப்ளோ இன் த பாத்ரூம் குளியல் அறையில் தண்ணி போக மாட்டது குளியல் அறை மீன்ஸ் த பாத்ரூம் த பிளேஸ் வை டேக் பாத் குளியல் இஸ் டேக்கிங் பாத் அறை குளியல் அறையில் தண்ணி போக மாட்டது த வாட்டர் டசன்ட் ஃப்ளோ வி ஹாவ் அ லார்ஜ் கார்டன் பிஹைண்ட் அவர் ஹவுஸ் வீட்டுக்கு பின்னாடி பெரிய தோட்டம் இருக்கு வீட்டுக்கு பின்னாடி தட் இஸ் பிஹைண்ட் த ஹவுஸ் பெரிய மீன்ஸ் பிக் தோட்டம் இருக்கு தோட்டம் இஸ் அனத வேர்ட் ஃபார் யூ லேர்ன் தோட்டம் மீன்ஸ் கார்டன் தோட்டம் வீட்டுக்கு பின்னாடி பெரிய தோட்டம் இருக்கு த வால் இஸ் டேம்ப் டியூ டு ரெயின் மழையில் சுவர் நினைஞ்சி இருக்கு மழையில் மீன்ஸ் இன் த ரெயின் பிகாஸ் ஆஃப் த ரெயின் மழையில் சுவர் தட் இஸ் த வால் நினைஞ்சி இருக்கு இட் ஹஸ் பிகம் வெட் நினைஞ்சி மீன்ஸ் வெட் இட் ஹஸ் பிகம் நினைஞ்சி இருக்கு சுவர் மீன்ஸ் வால் த வால் இஸ் டேம் டியூ டு ரெயின் மழையில் சுவர் நினைஞ்சி இருக்கு மைண்ட் த ஸ்டெப்ஸ் படிக்கட்டு பார்த்து படிக்கட்டு மீன்ஸ் த ஸ்டெப்ஸ் பார்த்து பார்த்து இஸ் அ வேர்ட் பி யூஸ் டு சே ஓ பி கேர்ஃபுல் படிக்கட்டு பார்த்து மீன்ஸ் ஓ தஸ் இஸ் ஸ்டேர் பி கேர்ஃபுல் படிக்கட்டு பார்த்து படிக்கட்டு மீன்ஸ் ஸ்டெப்ஸ் so when we say that we say ah padikattu paathu don't sit on the floor tharaiyila okkaradinga tharaiyila okkaradinga okkaradinga means we are talking to more either as a respect or we are talking to more than one person tharaiyila okkaradinga thara means floor tharaiyila means in the floor தரையில் உட்காராதீங்க ஆர் டோன்ட் சிட் ஆன் த ஃப்ளோர் டோன்ட் சிட் ஆன் த ஃப்ளோர் தரையில் உட்காராதீங்க இட் இஸ் ஹாட் இன் த டெரஸ் மொட்டை மாடியில் உஷ்ணமாக இருக்கு மொட்டை மாடியில் மீன்ஸ் மொட்டை மாடி மீன்ஸ் த டெரஸ் மொட்டை மாடியில் மீன்ஸ் இன் த டெரஸ் ஆர் ஓன் த டெரஸ் உஷ்ணமாக இருக்கு இட் இஸ் ஹாட் மொட்டை மாடியில் உஷ்ணமாக இருக்கு The wind blew the roof off. The wind blew the roof off. காத்தில் கூற பறந்து போச்சு காத்தில் means by the wind or through the wind. கூற 
that is the roof and because it, it flew away, it's blown away, we are talking about a more flimsy uh, thatched roof. Kure, parandu pochi. Parandu pochi means it's blown away, it flew away. Kure means roof. Kure is more the word we use for a roof of a building and kure, that is the word. Kaatthila kure parandu pochi. Don't lean on the pillars. Thunala sayada. Thunala sayada means on the on the pillars. Sayada, don't lean. Thun means pillar. Thunala sayada. Close the window. Janal kadava saate. Janal kadava is window door. In English we just say window which means it's just inclusive of the the frame as well as the, it's just the window which means also the door. In Tamil we sometimes say Janal kadavu, that is the each unit, that is the door of the window. Janal kadavu saate, close it. Hope you have learned a few useful phrases. If you like the video, be sure to subscribe and press the bell icon to be notified of new videos. If you have any suggestions, write them in the comment section. If you want any clarification, you can add them as well in the comment section. All the best with your Tamil learning. Have a nice day. Vanakkam Varthukal.